You keep your private <laughs> life very private, which is something that I admire. But I know that you're real proud of the spiritual connection to your wife. You were married, you did the civil thing, the marriage contract, and then you destroyed the contract and remarried spiritually. Explain that. Well, um, I, I had this hang up about uh, people touching her and putting their hands on her and hugging her and stuff like that. And I came to find out that it uh, really had to do with the word wife. I don't consider her my wife anymore because uh, that word used to make me, don't touch my wife, don't put your hands on my wife and things like that. And, um, before she was my wife, she was a child of God. And I've learned to just respect her and not be so possessive. And uh, she in turn is that way with me. And uh, I can have intimate relationships with other people, intimate meaning on a spiritual level. And I'm not talking about physicality, but uh, you know, you can sit down and break bread with somebody and just discuss uh, the fact that Christ is present. He's not coming, he's present. And it's time for all of us to kind of wake up to that fact and do our thing, you know.